In this video, I'm going to show you the fastest way to get raid tokens in this game right now because you need a lot of raid tokens for a lot of things actually. First of all, you have a lot of raid characters you can get right now. It's like over 20 or something because all of them are back. And then you also have the gotcha, which is 50,000 per, um, per pity. And then you also have the other uh, gotcha uh, this is not 50,000, but it's still 37,500 and you also have all the pets You need a lot of raid tokens So in this video, I'm going to show you the fastest way to get raid tokens or at least how many raid tokens you can realistically get in an hour now let's first just begin by uh, Checking every every single way to get raid tokens the obvious way is to do raids and speed raids raids You can do once every hour the more damage you do the more rewards you get and every reward has a chance of getting raid tokens now raid tokens now are doubled you have two times raid tokens which basically never comes up only on anniversaries or something like that a very special event uh, basically like once or twice a year so you should definitely use this opportunity instead of either getting two or three raid tokens you will get either uh, four or six raid tokens which is double so that's really, really good, and you should definitely play raids. Now it's the same for speed raid, uh, so definitely play a lot right now, now that it's summer and it's two times raid token events. Other way to get raid tokens, just random ones. Uh, for one thing you can get is one free raid token or 20 free raid tokens every day. I'm not gonna count that in in this one hour thing, but obviously if you do, uh, this for uh, this one hour strategy that I'm going to show you you can get more than just that for 24 hours because there are all other things you can do every day that I'm not gonna count in towards this hour but you can get 20 raid tokens here you can also do your daily quest which I recommend you doing for 125 raid tokens once you complete all of them it's not that hard to do and 125 raid tokens does actually help there's also a new code three years it will give you 800 raid tokens which is insane and then all of the other random codes on the code milestone will also give you a bunch of raid tokens now recently added things in the boss rush you can now convert boss rush tokens to raid tokens so for 125 raid, uh, boss rush tokens i can buy 100 raid tokens so it's the five to four ratio so I have 9,922 raid tokens, uh, boss rush tokens, I can get around 8,000 raid tokens. That's quite a lot. And each boss rush, if you get S tier, so 16 rewards under 4 minutes, gives you quite a lot of boss rush tokens. So if we have uh, 16 rewards, free to play, I'm gonna count everything free to play, times the multiplier uh, or the percentage you get uh, boss rush tokens, which is 99.6% and multiply that by 3.5 because you either get three or four boss rush tokens once you do get boss rush tokens it's 55.776 bo uh, boss rush tokens every single boss rush so how many uh, raid tokens is that well it's a five to four ratio so let's divide by five and multiply by four every single boss rush you do is 44.620 uh, raid tokens, so it's quite a lot of raid tokens you can get with this update that you can now uh, Convert boss rush tokens to raid tokens. So that is something you should definitely do Every day you can do one boss rush token a uh, boss rush for free, but I'm not gonna count that in right now Now how do we get boss rush tickets now from the raid you can actually get boss rush tickets I'm not gonna count that in right now, but one thing you can do is buy them you can buy them for 200 gems. Now 200 gems, you get gems from the raid, which you can then also, because in the raid, you get gems and boss uh, and raid tokens. Now the gems do not give you raid tokens, but they do actually, indirectly. The gems you get from raids, you can actually convert into boss rush tickets, which you can convert into raid tokens. So every single gem you get, you can also convert to raid tokens. Now, the last thing, you can do to get raid tokens is the newly added addition of beating a dimension giving you gems so the highest dimension giving you 62 gems 
and just be before that it's 29 so the highest dimension is definitely the best one to do though do one that you can do safely if you cannot do this last dimension probably do a really easy one like maybe sword dimension because 18 gems versus alien dimension 29 gems it's not that much bigger for difference yes 50 percent but if you're just like level 141 you will beat alien dimension in like 10 minutes and uh, and ghoul dimension or whatever in in one or two minutes and you can do this one five times as fast so you can do that five times once you well you can do alien dimension once and the same goes if you cannot do this level dimension fast you should actually do a easier one faster than just doing the level dimension however if you can do uh, this level dimension, if you level 151, followed my uh, raid character guide, bought Asta, got assists, got a few, uh, followed my tutorial on how to get more damage, you should be able to beat and play and beat this level dimension. I'm gonna say that if you average 3 minutes per dimension, I can average like 1 minute and 40 seconds, but that's not realistic for most of you guys, I'm gonna average 3 minutes. So, and every three minutes, we get 62 gems. So, let's actually get an overview now. You can do raids, you can do speed raids, and you can do dimensions to get gems, convert them into boss rush tickets, do boss rush and convert them into raid tokens. This is much better than actually playing or going into the AFK chamber, because that one, without any VIP game passes, get two raid tokens per five minutes and that's not a lot at all every single dimension is about 17 raid tokens these 62 gems if you convert them to raid tokens it's about 17 raid tokens so as long as you beat that before like 60 minutes which is the longest time is 14 minutes as long as you beat the dimension it's faster than doing the afk area even if you have vip so let's get into an overview. Now we have a quick, just real quick picture here of a span of 60 minutes. So here is zero minutes, here is 60, 60 minutes. We're gonna start at zero, zero, or for those living in some other time zone, just when raid starts. This is when raid starts, raid starts here. Um, let's write that uh, with a bit of a smaller size raid starts now raid takes eight minutes eight minutes and for eight minutes you're gonna play a raid now these eight minutes you're gonna play raid and get as many rewards as possible it's possible to get more than 70 rewards if you were to get 70 rewards it would be about um about this many of the rewards would be raid tokens and then an average of five per right now, you will get 276 raid tokens per raid. Now I'm gonna do it more realistically for you viewers. Let's say you get 50 rewards. About, uh, let's see, about 39 of these rewards will be raid tokens. And these 39 raid token, uh, rewards will be uh, about 197 uh, 197.3 raid tokens you can get just from doing the raid for eight minutes that's really really good i'm not joking that's really good and this is because of the two times raid token event otherwise you would get 98.65 now you could theoretically get 73 rewards or something and everything is rate tokens you can get 365 and if you get like less rewards 40 rewards get lucky maybe just 24 of those rewards rate tokens you could get 120 but on an average if you get 50 rewards 197.3 rate tokens per raid now after a raid ends these two minutes before 10 minute mark you will play speed raid this speed raid is really good as well and the cooldown on speed raid is actually just 30 minutes now let's go back into the game the cooldown on a speed raid is now 30 minutes you can play it every 30 minutes so these minutes you're playing here 8 to 10 minutes you're gonna play speed raid 
and you can get quite a lot of rewards actually now you can get 20 rewards if you get it under two minutes now 20 rewards is quite a lot and it's about the same percentage as um as a raid so if you get 20 rewards uh you can get zero point about this many rewards will be raid tokens oh i did it wrong 20 egg times 0 0.7892 this many rewards will be raid tokens multiply it by five you get this many ray tokens and this is pretty good as well let's see how many it was 78.92 78.92 ray tokens if you play the speed raid here and then after this the 10 minutes and the zero minutes you need to get do it bef below 10 minutes and be be because you need to get the 20 rewards after that you have a lot of time. You have 50 minutes, which you have to spend without doing a raid, without doing a speed raid right now. And prior to the updates, the best way was to go into AFK chamber. And there, there for about 45 minutes, you could get rewards. You would get um, seven, no, you would get nine rewards. So 18 raid tokens. 18 raid tokens is not that much, but now you can play dimension. You can play the level dimension and you can get a lot of gems. Now, let's say we average three minutes. If we average three minutes, we get 62 or actually we have. So let's play for 30 minutes speed rate for, uh, or dimensions for 30 minutes. Uh, we have 10 dimensions. We're going to clear then and then 62 gems per. We're going to get 620 gems. That's really, really good. And let's see how many boss rush uh, tickets can we get for 620 gems. We get three whole boss rush tickets and then 20 extra. Let's divide it by 200. We get 3.1 boss rush tickets per, uh, per 30 minutes here. 3.1 boss rush tickets, as you can remember before, one uh, boss rush got about 50 I know th I think it was yeah 50 something we can calculate that again actually at 50 something rewards uh, or 50 something ray tokens um, so we got 3.1 here under four minutes you get 16 rewards and 99.6 percent of the time you're gonna get boss rush tokens and this is 3.5 an average 55.776 boss rush tokens on average now this divided by five multiplied by four is 44.62 rate tokens per boss rush and we have 3.1 boss rushes so in these 30 minutes we're going to get 138 uh rate tokens play dimensions If you play Dimensions, you're gonna get 138.3 RT. That's a lot of raid tokens as well. It's more than the speed rate. It's almost on par with the raid. And compared to the 18 raid tokens you got from the AFK chamber, this is insanely good. Now, what happens if you can't do it in three minutes? Let's say you do this Dimension in 10 minutes. You then do three Dimension runs in these 30 minutes. And that is 62 times 3. Now this divided by 200 is just 0 0.93 boss rush uh, tickets. Now this divide uh, multiplied by around 44 is still 40 ray tokens. So even if you do it in 10 minutes, you still get more than if you were to go into the AFK chamber. So in these uh, 40 minutes or 30 minutes, I would play dimensions to get as many ray tokens. And the faster you do it, the more raid tokens you will get. Now, if you do it in two minutes, you can obviously do more. 30 minutes, 15 times, times 62, divided by 200, multiplied by around 44, you can get 204 raid tokens. And that is really, really good. If you were to play for an hour and average um, two minutes per, you get 62. 
Uh, no, wait, wait, let's do it again. 60 divided by 2, 30 times we're going to clear it. 62, this is how many gems you're going to get. Divided by 200, this is how many boss rush tickets. And then around 44. For over 400 raid tokens, just by playing Dimensions if you beat the Dimension fast. So Dimensions are actually really good now. And it will definitely benefit a lot of the Dimension characters. And you should definitely focus a lot more on Dimension than you have had before. Anyway, now we have Speed Raid again. Speed Raid. Speed Raid. And you do the same thing. It's the same thing. Actually, let's extend the ray token here or the arrow here and we have 78.92 again that's until 42 42 minutes and for the rest of the 18 minutes left 18 minutes if you average three minutes per you you'd beat the dimension six times multiply that by 62 divide that by 200 multiply by around 44 you get another 80 to raid tokens and this is the complete hour after this you have the raid open again and you start over at the raid and this is what you will do throughout the whole 60 minutes once raid opens play raid and then you go into a speed raid after you've done the speed raid you play dimensions for 30 minutes do the speed raid and play dimensions for 18 minutes and then you go into the raid again that's the whole hour i mean it's a lot of stuff to do and if you don't want to do this it's 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 fair i understand you but this is how to get as many raid tokens realistically as possible in one hour if you can't do a lot of damage if you can't get 50 rewards in raid and if you can't get um if you can't get uh, under two minutes in uh, speed raid and under four minutes in boss rush, then yeah, it's okay. You don't have to uh, rely on these numbers, but uh, yeah, you're gonna get many raid tokens, just not as much as these. Now, total, this is 197.3 raid tokens plus 78.92 plus 78.92 because you do two speed rates plus 138.3 plus 82 now you get 575 rate tokens every hour now like i said maybe you will get less if you don't do the dimensions as fast if you don't do the I, I get as many raid tokens uh, in raids you can also get more if you do the dimension faster if you do uh, get more raid rewards you can get more than this and you can get less than this this is just a realistic answer if you do this for maybe eight hours a day you get 4600 raid tokens in a day for just playing eight hours I mean, 8 hours is still a lot, but 4,600 raid tokens, that's enough to buy a lot of stuff. Now, remember how I said that the gems can convert into boss rush tickets, and you can play boss rush to get raid tokens? You still have to play the boss rushes, so in reality, you have to cut off some of those raid tokens. So instead of 575 raid tokens, maybe you get 500 raid tokens, or 550 more realistically, and then you put away some time to play boss rushes but as you could see it's not a lot of boss rushes it's like maybe five boss rushes if you do it fast if you do it really fast maybe eight if you do it really slow maybe just two boss rushes and if you do it really fast you're gonna be able to do the boss rushes really fast anyway so it's not that significant but yeah you have to put away some time to do boss rushes so for me i need to put away some time to do 310 boss rushes but you can also save them up, play what, like 100 boss rushes in one day or something like that. But that's one hour you can get over 500 raid tokens, even if you count in playing the boss rushes. Over 500 raid tokens in one hour is awesome and you should definitely utilize this two times raid token event to get as many raid tokens as possible. Now, in a day... Let's see how many raid tokens we can get. Now, let's say we get 73 rewards. Now, multiply that by how many raid tokens we can get. 
uh, or raid rewards, that's about five. We get 288 raid tokens from one raid. The speed raid, we get 20 rewards, multiply that by uh, 7892, uh, and multiply that by five, multiply that by two, multi uh, add the raid rewards. This is how many raid tokens you get from the raids and speed raid. You can also get more from the uh, dimensions. Let's say we have uh, how many minutes? It's 48 minutes divided by 2, multiplied by 62, divided by 200, and multiply by 44. Add what we had 773 raid tokens every single hour if you are really good. Now, as well, multiply this by 24, we have 18,558 raid tokens. We can also do daily quests, that's 125 extra, you get 20 extra for just logging in, and you have 18,700 raid tokens. You also have the free boss rush tickets, and you will also get uh, gems from the raid, boss rush tickets from the raid, so you will get extra rewards from that, extra boss rush tickets from that, extra raid tokens in that case, and you will probably get over 20 thousand raid tokens every day if you play for 24 hours and you have a lot of damage that the the possibility to get 20,000 raid tokens in a day is not that likely but it is possible it is really possible but realistically like i told you before over 500 raid tokens every hour is realistic for a lot of you guys. You could also get 750 raid tokens every hour. You could also get less at 250 raid tokens an hour, but it's still a lot of raid tokens. So definitely do this strategy, play raid, play speed raid, do dimensions, and then play the speed raid again and do more dimensions. That's it for this video. That's how you get as many raid tokens as possible for you to know so you can grind away in this event. And yeah, I hope you enjoy this video and see you in the next one.